Hello and welcome to week five of Hamped Up. This week we are featuring girls soccer. I'm here with Olivia and Sydney and we're here to talk about the girls soccer team. So the first question, obviously injuries have been a big part of this season, especially with the injury to Sydney White. So what was that game like when she went out with the injury and you didn't really have a backup goalie? Everybody was just in total shock. The entire stadium was silent. And, um, <laughs> I, she was just kind of laying there and we're all like, okay, give her some space, and then everybody came over and it was like a 15 minute thing, um, and we all came there like, oh my gosh, we don't have a goalkeeper, because usually our games with, are with JV, and so Sid is like right next door, and yeah. she can come play, and then someone's like, okay, call Sid, call the other Sid, call the other Sid, and so someone from the stand, someone's dad, called Sid, she drove at that moment all the way from her game at JFK. Go 80 miles per hour. <laughs> 80 miles per hour just to be with us. So what was that like for you when you got that call and you're like, hey, come play with us? <laughs> it was it was not how I pictured to get called up to varsity because I loved it. I was like, just my mentor. So this team kind of had a big culture change this offseason. You have a new coach. So what has that been like for you and the team? Vanessa came in and she was like, I'm not going to take any of your guys' crap. If you do anything, you know, I'm going to be right there with you. I played on a high school team myself, um, and she played D1 soccer, and so she really understands the game. All right, so you guys have had a tough stretch, especially since Sydney's injury, but you have the next five games at home, uh, only six games left in the regular season, so what are you guys planning on doing to turn the season around? We want the championship, we gotta earn that championship, and that's how we earn it, by practicing, like we got left. Mm -hmm. And we want to win, and especially, you know, there's only three seniors on our team this year, and. Um, without that kind of, I mean, obviously the juniors care a lot too, but when you're a senior, you like, you want to win. You want your last season to be really good. And there's only three of us. And so that drive, you know, it's all of us want to be lead every single um, practice and say, okay, come on, like, we want to get hyped up. We want to say, okay, we're going to play 100% just like we play in a game. All right, well, thank you guys so much for being here. Good luck the rest of the season. Thank you. Thank you. In other sports news, the boys' soccer team currently sits in second place in their league. Both the boys and girls cross country teams are still undefeated, the field hockey team is in first place in their league, the golf team is in last place, and finally the football team beat Putnam 28-6 this past week and debuted the Wildcat offense. The Blue Devils have a tough opponent this week as they travel to Westfield to conclude their four-game road trip.